All right, peeps, these are super sweetnesses. I had to show this to people, and I, I, <clears throat> I did a video about my art projects last week, and I, I started building these meditation benches the other day, and I built one because I came across it by chance, and it happened to be a synchronicity that came into play that was just designed, it was just meant to be. Um, I found plans for these simple meditation benches, and I have problems kneeling and sitting cross-legged, so I made them, and the first one I made here, and they're really simple, they're only 20 inches long, you can make them, you know, various sizes, I could give you the sizes, but you cut the bottom parts at a 15 degree angle, right? This one just has beads wrapped around it, but, um, and that's it, you know, like 8 inches or something on the back, you know, to fit your feet. I have mine designed this way. Anyway, I decided to start selling them to, uh, you know, because I've been looking for a small projects, something that I can sell online to make make a little bit of money but I don't want to it's not to make money it's to keep myself occupied and to pay for the supplies while I make them because I really enjoy it so I make these in little tables and put my love into them the current design I haven't worked out so I just have screws showing right now because I don't mind on mine but look at this wood I mean dude this is purple heart and it is just gorgeous and I know it's not gonna come out as good when I'm looking on the camera but it's super refractive it's almost like a tiger's eye and this stuff is like 40 bucks for one board of it and I lacquered the hell out of it, as you can see. And it's, the stuff is just gorgeous. I love it. I love it. I love it. Anyway, the table is designed so you can sit with your legs, you know, wrapped on the inside. And so, you know, you have more freedom. Um, I really, I really dig this. Anyway, so here's the first one. It was the Purple Heart. And this one, I made a little bit wider for a slightly bigger person. And this one was out of uh, Black Walnut. Or, uh, sorry, sorry, Peruvian Walnut. Uh, and see, I'm, as a carpenter, I make all kinds of random stuff, and I have a lot of uh, exotic woods that I'll buy at times, and, and have like cut-off pieces, and I don't like to waste. I like to be as environmentally friendly as I can, so by having little stuff like this, I can really salvage all this stuff. So, look at that gloss. I mean, that's just, those two, those two are just gorgeous. I, I love the way they turn out. Uh, I love the wood, and, uh, but this is the one. This is, uh, <laughs> this is called Paduk. And it is absolutely beautiful wood. God, I'm, I'm sitting here watching it shimmer, but I know that's not how it looks on the camera. Um, this stuff is like tiger's eye. It's unbelievable. So, this is going to be the next project, and I cannot wait to see how they turn out. I just wanted to share these with people, because anybody who's into meditation will love these little tables. They kick ass, and they're really easy to build. Really easy. So... If anybody wants to know how to do it, let me know and I'll give you the dimensions and shit. They're really simple. Peace.